Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the ranking history module inside of App Analytics. In this example, we're using Clash of Lords as the app we're studying. So let's start by going across the top of the screen and taking a look at what this module has to offer. If there's ever a point where you don't understand what a feature does, just look for these green learn bubbles and it'll give you more information on how the module works. So for example, in this case, this bubble will show you what ranking history is all about. Now moving to the right side of the screen, you can change the country that you're examining and you can examine iPhone or iPad since this is an iOS app. If this was an Android app, you wouldn't have an option at the top. Now moving down to the graph, you can see when this graph was updated. You can see the graph either hourly or daily. And that's really useful in seeing the volatility of this category. Then you can change the date to use a custom date. And if you don't want to see all of these lines, then you can scroll down and click on any of these labels at the bottom. And that line will automatically disappear. And the label will also turn gray. If you click on it again, then you'll get the the graph back. That's really useful if there's too many lines on a graph and you just want to see certain ones. And this goes for any uh, graph that's in the mobile action dashboard. Next, we're going to take a look at comparing your app to another app. So if you added a competing app, it'll show up in the choose a competitor menu here. When we click on this, we get one competitor that, that we're tracking. So when you click this checkbox here, you'll also get the rankings for that app. Again, if you want to remove these lines because it can get kind of busy, click on the label and the line will disappear. Then at the bottom, you'll see the daily rankings and important information for each app. Since we're comparing a competing app, that app also appears in this list. So you can get the category ranking as well as uh, the most recent update on the ranking change. Uh, that goes for both the category and the overall ranking. And you can get the visibility score for each app. If you watch our video on visibility score, you'll probably remember that visibility score is our overall measure of how well the app shows up in different countries on the App Store. And finally, if you want to export all this information to CSV, you can click on this link here and get a CSV download. All right, I hope that helped and thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed that video and found it useful. Before you go, make sure to get your App Store Optimization Specialist Certificate. If you pass our course, Mobile Action will certify that you know App Store optimization. This can help you impress employers, create trust with potential clients, and get referrals. People are always asking us about App Store optimization services, but we don't provide these services, so that's when we refer these potential customers to our specialist network. You will also get access to specialist-only events around the world, and much, much more. So visit academy.mobileaction.co to get started.